Tops 1. Applying Homeowner Late Fees To apply homeowner late fees, we begin by clicking on Accounts Receivable on the menu. And then Charges. You can either click on the black Apply Late Fee box on the right or click on Actions. And then Late Fees. If you neglected to select the community before choosing this function, you can always change the community at the top of the page. To update your posting date, click on the calendar to the right of the post date. And then select the correct date. The Apply Late Fees function can also be scheduled. We're not going to schedule this function, so we'll choose this time only. You can also choose which of your recurring charges the late fees should be applied for. Because I'm applying March late fees, I'm going to turn off the application for the quarterly special assessment. Scrolling down will allow us to view the homeowners who meet the criteria to be charged a late fee. Once all of our settings have been updated, click Accrue to accrue the charges. We're now given the details of our accrued late fees. You can see the charge total and number of homes being charged, along with the associated GL accounts for the charge. Further down, you will see each of the homeowners included in the late fee batch. You can edit the late fee amount for a particular owner by clicking the pencil icon to the right of that owner, and then changing the dollar amount of that owner's charge. To save the change, click the check. You can also delete an owner from the batch by clicking the X icon to the right of that owner. That owner is no longer included in the batch. If we scroll back to the top of the batch, you can see that the late fee total has been updated to reflect our changes. Click Post to apply the charges to the owners. Our posted late fee batch is now displayed on our AR activity feed. To see the details of the batch, click the down arrow to the right of the batch. Let's add a comment to this batch to make a notation of the changes that were made prior to posting. First we'll enter a general subject. And then enter the details. Click Add Comment to save. We can view our comment at the bottom of the batch. Clicking the down arrow in the comment section will reveal our comment details. Click the down arrow again on the batch to hide the batch details. This concludes our Tops 1 Applying Homeowner Late Fees tutorial. Thank you.